So I'm in my uh, high-tech Airbnb suite. I was just about to do a DIY project and I was like, you know what? I gotta film this. Uh, basically, you see that right over there? See that bar? I'm trying to make it like a smart bar. It's already got lights, it's voice activated. But what I wanna do is make it so that you could drop your phone right on the bar and it will wirelessly charge your phone. And we're gonna do it with this gadget right here. It's from Millie. Uh, this is their Furniture Mate. And basically what it is, is you put this underneath a table or a desk, a pre-existing one, and basically it has this little sticker on here, so it'll stick underneath, you plug it in, then you got this little thing that you put on top, and then every time you drop your phone, it will charge. So I wanna see if this thing works. Thankfully, because I already got those lights down there, I already have a power source that's hidden. I put a power bar down there. So it shouldn't be that hard to do, but I'm really curious to see if it will actually work if it can charge my phone. So. Let's go and uh, get to work. Okay, so I've kind of decided that I want to put it right around here. That's where I want to have the station. So, let's see. Now I'm gonna have to take this sticker off and hopefully that is sticky enough. And I'm gonna have to try to Maybe I'll just eyeball it at first. And I do have a power bar right here, so I will make this cabling look nice and clean if it works. But for now, I just want to test this out. So I'll just leave everything like that. And then we'll have to go up. Now, the funny thing is I'm actually filming this on my phone, so you're not gonna be able to see if it's gonna get charged. But that's it, man, like that is... <laughs> You want to do a little bit of work of just trying to hide this and I can show you a little cool trick to be able to do that. But if this works, um, it's just such an easy way to retrofit any kind of bedside table or your desk or in this case a bar and get it some charge. So let's uh, check it out. Now the last step is putting uh, this mat down and I could try to eyeball it but I used the measuring tape down there and saw that it was about 10. So maybe right over there, I can kind of see a mark there, and then nine. So, basically I'm gonna put it right, right around there. So I'll take that off. And you know what, I'll take this right off. And I know it's gonna be just around there. I'm just gonna look underneath. Oh, and that looks pretty damn close. Now all I have to do is put my phone down and see if it charges. So I got some good news. I was able to get my phone to charge on here. Of course, I'm filming with it. That's why I can't show you. But it wasn't where I kind of marked this. I think the best way to do it is you put your phone down and then you move this around until your phone starts to charge. Then you know for sure that that's the exact spot. You want it right in that sweet spot in the middle. And that actually made it best for me to get it to, to know where to charge. At first, I wasn't even sure if it was gonna work or not, but this is pretty thick. It's almost close to 40 uh, millimeters, but this works. And now that I found right over here, uh, I'll just be able to put the tape off here and then drop it exactly at that spot. So another tip I think I might do is once I do it, I'll trace it so that when I drop it, it'll be exactly where it wants because there's really not much room for error over here, but yeah, this is a fantastic way to basically turn any kind of surface into a wireless charger. And this is from Millie, and it's their Furniture Mate. They have two versions, one to retrofit and another version for if you're gonna build furniture that you could actually design it to have it pre-built in. And I think that one, the power output is 10 watts, whereas this one is five. Of course, if you like how-tos and DIY and tech, I'm your guy. My name is Handy Andy. Make sure you subscribe.